High school football returned to Eastern Connecticut Friday night. It looked different with masks instead of helmets, but it still felt the same for Fitch coach Mike Ellis. You know what? I was uh, nervous just like I was always nervous before a Friday night game coming, coming up. Um, and I don't know why, but I still was. Before the game, the teams gathered at midfield and several players spoke about racial injustice. In this, in this country that we live in, there's plenty of people who can look at someone like me or someone like number nine, someone like number six, and they see a criminal, an animal, a savage. I mean, this is something for me personally, it's super, like, super important and I'm super passionate about it. The traditional 11 on 11 game was replaced by a seven on seven passing competition in a series of lineman challenges that tested players' strength and speed, earning seven points for the winning team in each event. Yeah, being out on the spotlight, it was a, it was different for us because we're usually in the trenches, you know, doing the hard work, but we don't usually get the shine on us. So coming out, it felt different. It felt like we had the spotlight on us, and it felt good. It like, felt really good for us. I think the best part about it is you had the emotions. You got tested, right? You had big plays where you get excited, and, and can we control our excitement on a big play and move on to the next play? Um, and obviously, you had negative plays. How do you respond to that adversity? Um, those are things that we weren't getting necessarily in practice, and, and you're only going to get them in a competitive manner, right, where, where you're playing against another team. And they're going to get the excitement on a big play, and we're going to get the opposite side of it. Um, and it for, for us, it's just a great opportunity to have that. I mean, it felt somewhat normal. Fitch proved superior in both aspects of the competition, coming away with a 48-21 win over NFA. The experience was nice to have for the kids with the situation that we're in. It's not the 11 on 11, it's not what we would all like, but at the same time, we're in the middle of a pandemic and we've got to, we've got to do the right thing. And I'm just thankful that the ECC set this up for us to do. Uh, what it's done is it's given the kids a focus and a goal and allowed them to work towards something. And it's allowed some of the things that normally are the positives about a team where you have to face adversity, you have to work with each other. We're still getting those, uh, those things taught throughout the team through this. So, uh, listen, we had, a good, we had a good time tonight. It was a fun time coming up here, and we'll just take what we can get.